no one has done what Roman Reigns has done in the modern era. Roman Reigns has been able to elevate Jey Uso, Jimmy Uso, and now Solo Sakoa to the top level, working with them for this long. There was nobody else that has done this. John Cena, you only elevated to the level where he works with you. After one, two matches, you go down. The Rock, after one, two matches, you're done. You're buried, as they will say it in WWE. But Roman Reigns, for one thousand days has made jimmy uso relevant has made jay uso relevant has made solo sakura relevant all of them were nothing before roman reigns yes i mean the twins they had won they were jumping around like beds and all this kind of stuff and everything in the, in the ring and all of that but nobody respected them to the level that they are respected right now acknowledge him stop pause the video right now pause it and lift up your hand do it do it. Do it. Now, you, you hear that music. That is it. 1,000 days. Lagos, Nigeria, Africa, acknowledge him. Sorry, I had to put that there. Sorry. Okay, now back to the topic. John Cena said it very, very eloquently when he said that nobody has done what Roman Reigns has done. And he has elevated everybody to the level that nobody has ever done. You have not found a faction, a family, where all of them are relevant at the highest and apex level. Jimmy Uso can go on his own right now and have very, very great individual matches with anybody and go and get a title. Jey Uso can do the same. Any of them can challenge Roman for the title. Any of them can challenge for any title. All of them have their own connection with the fans. And you could see it when they betrayed Roman Reigns. Of course, Jey Uso stood aloof as Jimmy Uso gave him the super kick and he fell down. Two super kicks. But the truth about this is this. All of them can go out right now and own individual belts and have different reactions to the crowd and there will be a pop each time all of them, each of them should come out. No one has ever done that. This is the first time that it has been done and this is the first time that a heel is love-hated. <laughs> to a level. I mean, he's hated by the crowd, but when he comes out, I mean, you have to <laughs> acknowledge your tribal chief. Come on now. So the truth about this is this. Should Roman keep on going? 1,000 days counting, and he has passed it. He is not the highest ever in wrestling history to have done this. No, he's not. There are people that have held the belt for over 1,000 days. But he's the first in the modern era to have held it for over 1,000 days. And I believe that right now, the WWE totally depends on Roman Reigns. When he's not around, something seems to be missing. Especially when you look at the SmackDown brand and all of that. And of course, you know, if you're on the SmackDown brand, if you love it like I do, you, you, you would have wanted the ring announcer uh, to, to come on. Like Samantha Irvin, who announces Roman Reigns very well, but you know, because she announces Gunther too. Gunther Imperium! Because she announces that they have to move out to the raw brand. After six months, we need her back. We're borrowing you her. So the point is very simple. Roman Reigns needs to carry this belt for another 1,000 days. There is nobody that can collect that belt from him right now, realistically. Jeuso's story is still building. And you, you can look at it and say, oh, you know, Sami Zayn, Sami Zayn is out of the picture. There is nobody that can collect that belt from him. Every other person is under him. He is the one that makes it relevant. He is the one that makes you want to watch the show. He is the one that, that, that makes you want to look at Joe, so want to look at Jimmy, so want to look at everybody. He is WWE. And please don't come to me with Seth, Seth Rollins because, you know, Seth freaking Rollins. Oh, 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 forget that nonsense. That's rubbish. Roman Reigns is the one. He's the main guy. Seth Rollins is maybe like number two and everything. But you yourself, as the Seth Rollins fans, you know that without Roman Reigns, there is something missing. If Seth Rollins doesn't show up to work for like three months and we have Roman Reigns coming to work, that is perfect. But if Roman doesn't show up for one month, do you know how the ratings will drop? Do you know how infant attendance is going to drop? It's going to drop drastically. So at the end of the day, Roman right now is on the pedestal that no one has ever achieved in this modern era. No one has achieved it. And in those days when Roman was shoved into our throats and we were forced to love Roman and we hated him. But now we hate and love him together, you know.
Yeah. <laughs> but I like the way the story is turning out. The Usos have betrayed Roman Reigns. Uh, and, and right now, we're on the path where Roman is going to go solo. It's going to be only him and Paul Heyman. That's what I think. And Jimmy Uso and Jey Uso are going to be on the other path. And at the end of the day, there might be a feud again. But this time, I think that it's not going to be Jey Uso. I think that the feud is going to be with Jimmy Uso. And then Roman is going to beat them up. And maybe at the end of the day, they're going to bring in The Rock to defeat him and all of that. But, you know, we have to bring the big man because, you know, it's the family thing. The Rock somehow has to come back. That's the truth. But at the end of the day, this is the best storyline that, that WWE has had in the past 15 to 20 years. This is the best storyline. Because, like I said, it doesn't just elevate one wrestler. It elevates about four wrestlers together. This has been Chaos with Stone from Dominican Media. Right now, pause what you're doing. Stop what you're doing. Remove your hand from that place that it is, whatever. I know you're eating. Remove it. Go right now. Click on subscribe button. Subscribe. Like the video. And watch more videos on the YouTube channel, they have content for everybody. Even if you have a great grandfather and mother, they have content for that person. If you have a newborn baby that is six months old, there's content for that person. Just go right now, click on it and watch. It's not hard. Mm -hmm.